Hello friends, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. Netflix has canceled Daredevil. If you're new to the channel, please hit that like button, subscribe, hit that bell notification, I'll put out videos daily. Well, that's pretty much it. The f Netflix has canceled Daredevil. Season four is not happening after a very good season three. Now, I think there were some people holding out hope that they were simply going to be restructuring the Marvel Netflix shows. And, you know, Luke Cage gets canceled, Iron Fist gets canceled. So a lot of people were thinking, myself included, they were going to do Heroes for Hire, Daughters of the Dragon. And I think the real, real test was going to be whether they were going to cancel Daredevil. Arguably their most popular show. And they have. And... This is pretty much confirmation that Marvel's going to be done in Netflix. Uh, we do have Jessica Jones. We do have Punisher. But to my knowledge, they don't... Netflix does not have the rights to characters beyond these. And it's... Writing's on the wall. Uh, they're, the next two are probably done. Uh, it's really... That's it. Uh, everything's going to the Disney streaming service. I know Disney and Netflix have a kind of a... Kind of a... a you know, weird relationship right now because of that. And I think it, it's done. It's over. I think those shows as, um, you know, as good as they were for the most part, uh, yeah, that this era of Marvel is done. Uh, it, that's just, that's just the way it is. It sucks. But, you know, maybe that mo means we're moving on to greater things, bigger, better things over on the Marvel streaming, Disney streaming service. And, yeah, it's it stinks because I always I always like the Marvel Netflix stuff and I love Charlie Cox as you know Matt Murdock Daredevil. I feel that there was a lot more story to tell there and it, it's it that's it it's it sucks. Uh, but for me, honestly, I'm probably not even going to jump into Punisher or Jessica Jones. It's just I think it's pointless. You know, it's at this point they're it's it's done. It, it, it's over. So it's disappointing, you know, but at the same time, I, I firmly believe that what Disney streaming can give us will be great storytelling with great characters. Uh, I, I really think that they need to move away from the TV-ness of it. And while things like Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. continue on for another season, you know, we also have things on other, you know, Disney-owned networks like Freeform, ABC, and, you know, that's, that's it. I think Netflix is, this is pretty much that this is going to do it for the Marvel shows. Uh, I would expect cancellations to follow for Jessica Jones and for, um, the Punisher, you know, but I think I'm just, I'm kind of done. It's, it's, I don't think it's worth investing your, your time into at this point. So it's, it stinks because we're, while we get hard edge content on Netflix, which is a great thing. You know, we're not going to get that same hard edge in the Marvel and Disney streaming. It's just not what they're branded for. Can these characters or incarnations of these characters come back in some way? Who knows? Uh, that's a question for another day. But yeah, Daredevil season four is not happening. It's over. So that's it, guys. All right. A little sorry for that news. But yeah, please, you know, leave your comments below. What do you guys think? Uh, Please like, subscribe, hit that bell notification. Put out videos every day. Some good news, sometimes not. So <laughs> anyway, please, uh, please, uh, you know, do what you can. I appreciate it. So until next time, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. I will see you at the movies.